speaking to nurses and healthcare professionals, a couple of issues that come into play here. One is that healthcare is in such a state of flux right now. Stress levels are very high and the job market is becoming really competitive, both for the need for really high performing uh, healthcare professionals, as well as organizations competing against one another in the healthcare space. And so one avenue that I come in and talk to organizations for nursing and staff is about how they can better take care of themselves. Whether that's it's stress management, wellness, all of those areas come into play because quite frankly, you don't want someone taking care of you or your loved one who is all stressed out and uh, lacking in sleep and lacking in health. We have studies that show that people who have a high degree of stress, particularly in healthcare, uh, make more mistakes, give the wrong drugs more often, give the wrong treatments more often, um, accidents tend to happen. So you want a healthy, happy workforce. One nice thing about talking to nurses and healthcare professionals is that I have lived in that world. I grew up in a healthcare family. My father was a physician. My mother was an anesthetist. And if you don't know what an anesthetist is, that's the person that you pay hundreds of dollars to put you to sleep and thousands of dollars to wake you back up. So we had a family of healthcare. I grew up accompanying my father on um, home visits to people, literally carrying that little black bag. I grew up in hospitals, running around with the nuns chasing me at a Catholic hospital to get out of patients' rooms. So growing up amidst that and then becoming a nurse, um, I've held a dying person in my arms. I've helped deliver a baby, you know, from, from a baby's first laugh to a loved one's last breath. I've lived in that space. I've worked in that space. Um, I've cried with patients. I've cried with colleagues. We've laughed together. We've worked together. And I understand the language. I understand the lingo. I understand the challenges. I understand the frustrations. And I understand what's funny. <laughs> so healthcare in particular has a, an especially close place in my heart.